Hey everyone, welcome to The Natural Birth Show. I'm your host, Rachel, and today I am talking about breastfeeding and specifically some formula alternatives if breastfeeding is proving a challenge or just isn't an option for you. Before I get started, I just wanna point out that subscribe button down below. If you wanna learn more about natural birth, pregnancy, and postpartum, please push that subscribe button. Also, feel free to ask questions in the comments below and share this video to anyone you think it might be helpful for. So today, the topic is breastfeeding, specifically formula alternatives, but I wanna start with breastfeeding. Breastfeeding is such an amazing gift that our bodies naturally know how to do. It has been proven to be so much healthier for our babies than formula. But the problem is that breastfeeding can be hard, especially if you grow up in a culture where breastfeeding isn't the norm, especially if your family didn't breastfeed or you don't have a ton of friends who breastfed, it can feel just, it can be a really big challenge. So many women have challenges and that is normal and that is nothing to be ashamed of. And we wanna to try to power through those challenges if at all possible. But if for some reason we need to supplement our breastfeeding and our breast milk, we have a few options. The first option, and I personally believe is the best option, is to get donor milk. There are lots of women out there who produce extra milk and are happy to donate it to you for your baby. You also can check out Human Milk for Human Babies or there's there's uh, breast milk banks where you can go and you can purchase breast milk. Now that breast milk has to be heated to a certain temperature, but it is tested and it goes through all of these uh, protocols. So those are both awesome option, al options that are alternatives to going straight to formula. Formula can be challenging on the stomach. It can be hard for the baby to digest. It's, it's uh, got a lot of unnatural ingredients in it, especially if it's not an organic formula. It's not the end of the world. It can be life-saving, but donated human milk is an option. You also can make your own formula and that you might get a lot of pushback from a lot of doctors who have been taught that that's unsafe. But you, uh, Weston A. Price has a recipe for making your own formula from scratch that has more natural and whole food ingredients versus a store-bought formula. So that's an awesome option as well. If you do decide to go the powdered formula route, they're not all created equal and you wanna remember that too. So there are organic formulas out there. There are some formulas that are based on goat's milk instead of cow's milk, which tends to be a little gentler on the stomach. And then there were all kinds of formulas all over in between and you really have to do your research. So there are a lot of options. If you find yourself being one of those moms who has to supplement, and I'm not judging, I was one of those moms with my first child, I didn't know very much, I didn't have much help, I didn't have wise women who really knew much about breastfeeding and I ended up supplementing. And so I'm not judging at all. So if you are one of those moms like me who needed to supplement for any reason, then you have options. And that is the whole point of this video. So you want to research your options, you want to dig deep, and you want to find the one that is going to work best for you and your family and your baby. Again, guys, thank you for listening. And if you want to learn more about natural birth, pregnancy, and postpartum, please push that subscribe button, share this video everywhere, and feel free to check out the links below in the description, including my Buy Me A Coffee page, which, you know, no pressure there, but if you feel like you wanna support, that's right there for you. And then I also have a natural childbirth ed class you can check out that goes more in depth about breastfeeding and all things natural birth, pregnancy, and postpartum. And I have a podcast as well. So check that all out in the description below. And thank you so much for listening, guys. I'll talk to you in the next episode. Bye.